Hi everyone, in this tutorial I'll be talking to you guys about the public section, the private section and the protected sections. What are they? Why do you want to uh, define certain attributes, certain methods uh, in all these specific sections? So without wasting time let me get started and uh, let's do it in a practical way. Okay. So here I'm going to define my first class, initial class. Let me call this LCL underscore one. The name of the class here is LCL underscore one. Okay. Now I'll define an attribute v1 type i in the public section and in the protected section I'll define variable v2 okay and the private section I'll define an attribute v3 type i okay so here these are the three kinds of sections that can be used within a class okay section in the sense we are going to uh, uh, tell tell the system whether these attributes have to be shown to the outside world or not okay so let me show you what I'll, I'll just tell you in this in a while okay now here I'm going to create a class that inherits from LCL underscore one class okay and I'll have a public section and I'll have a method which is access underscore one okay so what I'm basically going to do here is I am declaring a class LCL underscore INH okay so this class is inheriting all the properties all the values from the super class here LCL underscore one is a super class and LCL underscore INH is the subclass okay so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to try to access each of these variables okay from the subclass this is the subclass here uh, make a note of it subclass and this is the super class I want to keep everything very simple and light guys okay Please follow with me. So, INH implementation. I'm going to create an implementation for this class because you have a method. Okay. Here, I'm not going to create any implementation because you don't have any method here. So, as I've told already in my previous lecture, that implementing a class means implementing the methods of the class. Okay. So, I'll uh, try to implement the method of the class okay here I'll try to access the first variable okay I'll try to set it to 10 I'll try to access the second variable I'll try to set it as 20 I'll try to access the third variable and set it to 30 okay so see here all these attributes belong to the super class LCL underscore one Okay, I am trying to access all these attributes from the subclass LCL underscore INH. Okay, and I'm trying to access the attributes from within the method of the subclass. Okay, so let me see if this is allowed. Okay, I'll check the syntax here. As you can see, field V3 is unknown. It is neither in one of the specified tables not defined by a data statement. So what does it mean? This means only one thing. V3 is in the private section. Okay. So whatever variables, whatever attributes you're writing, defining under the private section, it won't be visible in the subclass. Okay. You cannot, you cannot do this. That is why it is throwing you the 
syntax error. Now if I check it, the program is syntactically correct. Okay. So the protected section here, the main thing to note is that you, as you know, public section, whatever attributes you write inside public section is accessible across the program. Okay. So this is already defined. This is, there is nothing more to talk about this. It can be accessed in the subclass. And as well, the protected section can be accessed in the subclass. Okay, so V1 and V2 can be accessed. Okay. Now I'll do one more thing. I'll create one more class LCL underscore two definition. Okay. And I'll end the class here. Then a class LCL underscore two implementation. Sorry, I'm not. The keyboard uh, is not so good, so that's why I have the type problem. Okay. And class. Okay. So now what I'm going to do here is I'll declare a public section. I'll create a method. Okay. I will try to access one. Okay. Okay, so what I'm going to do here is with this method access one from the class LCL underscore two. Remember, this is a separate class. This is not an inherited class. Okay, this is a very separate class. And from within this class, I'm trying to access the attributes of class one. Let me see if what on all attributes can be accessed. Okay, so let me first try to create the object okay of the lcl underscore one class i'll create an object okay now here i'll try to access my variables oh and i'll try to set it to some values Okay, so here what I'm doing is I'm creating the object of the first class. Okay, that is the first class is the LCL underscore one. Okay, with the object reference. Object reference is LO underscore one. And in this step, I'm creating an instance of the LCL underscore one class. Okay, I'm creating the instance called LO underscore one of the LCL underscore one class. Okay, I'm creating the instance and I'm trying to access each and every attribute of the uh, class one and I'm trying to set some values. Let me say, check the in syntax here. Okay, sorry, it's a methods keyword. Okay, as you can see here, what do you observe? You observe that the protected attribute cannot be accessed in a different class. Here, LCL underscore two is a different class. LCL underscore one is a separate class. Okay, so here, the while checking the syntax, the system is saying that you cannot access protected section from a separate class from a different class. So this is not allowed. And as you can see, the private attribute access is also not allowed from a different class. The only attribute that you can access from a different class is the public attribute. Okay. So if you check the syntax now, the program is syntactically correct. That means Public section, whatever attributes you write under public section can be accessed from across the program, from anywhere, okay? But a protected section has a limitation. 
it can be accessed only from the subclass. In this case, LCL, it can be accessed only from LCL underscore INH class. Okay. And the private section. What is a private section? A private section can be accessed only from the respective class. Okay. You cannot access it from a inherited class. You cannot access it from a different class. Okay. I hope uh, the things are clear for you guys. I'll be talking about the friends class uh, concept with which you can you can you can have a control over the encapsulation in a later class. Thanks for watching, guys. Thank you.